We got Steve over here forming up the bridge. We're gonna pour that tomorrow. We've got the stonework around the spa completed. We've got the right side pillar completed. And now we just need to finish the left side pillar before going on to doing the grotto stones. And everything's being plumbed to go down to the equipment pad which will be poured down by the AC units. We got the stone masons hard at work building a beautiful wall here. So our first concrete pour was actually shooting the shell. Now we are going to be pouring our footers here for the columns. So right now they're just doing the finishing touches on the step forming and the bridge. And then once that's done, we'll have a nice way to come across the, the pool back to the house. Our third pour is going to be the footers for the pergola that goes across the whole back side of this pool. Here's the steps coming down into the lower pool, where this is kind of a nice place to have some lounge chairs, hang out, watch the waterfalls coming down. And then over here, you can walk right down into a, another deeper part, and this is the outdoor pergola area where there's the outdoor kitchen and the bar. So this is kind of like another little area to hang out and you can use this ledge and the bar. So instead of just having a negative edge basin to capture the water, this is a functional basin where we have the shallow area that I just showed you. And you can walk down here, be in a little bit more water, and you got a nice bar height here to hang out and have a drink. And then you can go underneath the bridge to the other side where you'll be right in the, in the dining room area. So then here I create a little destination seat rock where the waterfall's coming down. You can sit underneath the waterfalls here. This is where when you're in the pool, you come through the waterfall and you got the swim up bar right here. So we'll have a nice granite countertop here. And then a second level bar up at this height here for everybody in the spa so they can have their bar area as well. And then all this is under roof. Also notice, even though all these rocks are mortared together, it has a very dry laid natural look. And we achieved that by getting tight joints, also keeping the mortar raked back and using a brown dye in the mortar so the mortar matches the rock so it doesn't stand out with the, the shiny gray mortar that you see time and time again. <laughs>